CIET and CERT presents the series of English stories. Learning to listen and listening to learn. Friends, let's listen to this program and enjoy. The Camel and the Cunning Fox. The fox is known for its cunningness. The lion is known for his ferociousness. What are the leopard the wolf and the camel known for tell your friends before you listen to the story the camel and the cunning fox now listen to the story once there was a lion he was the king of the forest he had three ministers a leopard a wolf and a fox one day a merchant's camel lost his way and came into the forest the leopard the wolf and the fox brought him to their master at first the camel was afraid of the lion but the lion saw him and soon the two became friends the lion made him one of his ministers The leopard was strong and beautiful. The wolf was brave and the fox was very clever. The lion liked all three of them. The camel was not brave, beautiful or clever. He was ugly. But he was honest and the lion loved him for that. But the leopard, the wolf and the fox hated the new minister the king is very fond of his new minister they said he does not love us now the camel is our enemy one day the lion fell ill for week he lay ill in his cave he called the leopard the wolf and the fox and said i am very hungry i cannot go out to hunt please get me some food so the three ministers went out to hunt the camel was not a hunter so he stayed behind on their way the fox said to the leopard and the wolf listen to me let's not go and hunt we shall kill our enemy the camel he has a big body there will be enough flesh for the king and for us too but the lion is very fond of the camel said the leopard we can't kill him i have a plan said the fox he whispered his plan in the ears of the leopard and the wolf that is a good plan said both his friends they came back to the lion in the evening they bowed to him and said sir we hunted all day but got nothing what shall i do said the lion i am dying of hunger now the cunning fox said to the leopard and the wolf our king is dying of hunger you are hungry too please kill me and eat my flesh I will give my life to save you all. Not at all, said the leopard and the wolf together. You want to save our lives, but you have a small body, and your flesh will not be enough for the three of us. Then the wolf said, "Please kill me, and let the king eat my flesh. I will gladly die to save him." No. said both the fox and the leopard at once you have a small body too and your flesh will not be enough for the three of us and we don't want to lose you the leopard now bowed to the lion and said please kill me and eat me no said the lion i will not kill my faithful ministers just to save my life the poor camel did not know the aim of his enemies 
He now bowed before the lion and said, Sir, please kill me and eat me. At once the fox, the wolf and the leopard fell on him and killed him. What do you feel about the leopard, the wolf and the camel? Now, say yes or no to the following questions. If you wish, you may ask your teacher to play the story again. Did the camel go for food hunting? Yes or no? Did the three ministers go for hunting? Yes or no? Was the camel honest? Yes or no? Did the fox do the good thing? Yes or no? Was the lion responsible for the death of the camel? Yes or no? Since you are just listening to this program, we hope you have a pleasure listening to it. Project Coordination, Prof. R. Meghanathan Recorded by Bati Lang Lingdo and Mayank Kumar Special Contribution, Vimlesh Chaudhary Production Assistance, Amit Kumar Edited, Directed and Produced by Ajit Horo This program was brought to you by CIET-NCERT, New Delhi, India